What's up my single chads and defeated gamers, what I'm about to show you right now and what you are about to see in this video is surely gonna knock your socks out and the heat that you're gonna get through your mobile phones and through your monitors depends on where you're watching. Are you watching on a phone? If you're watching on a phone, don't worry man, I'll just flip the camera around like that. Yeah. Guys, like this video, share this video because what you're about to see is absolute insanity. You, Roll it. you can now stay it, completely undetected over. while it's cheating in Call of Duty. It's Joe. What if I told you, you can now stay completely undetected, while cheating in Call of Duty? These Warzone streamers have been doing this for years. Accessing Man. and processing application memory, needs to be done deeper than the anti-cheat. But how is this possible, if the anti-cheat, monitors at the kernel level? It does not work! It does not work! Simple as that, Well, bro. that's because we need to go deeper, way beyond the operating system. He but I go in another dimension right now. To a realm, where software is not required. We leave the anti-cheats behind, as we dive deeper, to a level ready, even boys. deeper than the negative ring layers of the Intel architecture. So deep, that the anti-cheat is simply off limits. I just wish that you would also go deep on me, Bruh. Call of Shane, Shane. To a lot. level, that is the physical hardware. Nothing, can be detected here. And this, changes everything. This is Bruh. direct memory access, or DMA for short. And what you're looking at, guys, these things are actually dead ass making these PCIe slots hardware for the 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 the, the cheating. Bro. It is Java, bro. It is Java. PC gaming as we know it. I'm sorry. I know there are some PC masters watching that does not cheat, and shout out to you. But you know for the fact that console players don't want to play with you. You also don't want to play with other cheaters on the PC, right? PC gamers done so. As a brown man, I demand. For these companies to issue uh, us refund, uh, okay? Bruh. Like the video if you agree. As a brown man, I demand online to be free. Like if you agree. As a brown man, I also demand the crossplay to be between consoles only. Okay, there. Okay, if there's like a uh, an option for a PC, PS5, and Xbox, well, yeah, sure. But we also need PS5 and Xbox only crossplay. Like if you agree, bro. Since early Warzone, these have been available for private customers, paying thousands of dollars. But something has now changed, and DMA cheats are now offered to the public, similar to the familiar cheats you see online. Remember, all those used to be private. These streamers have been cheating for years, completely undetected. While the cheaters are using software, the streamers are using hardware. Let me explain how this works. Oh my god, so this is why they were all happy all the time. Works. Direct memory access cheats, or DMA for short, are a big problem. They are completely <laughs> undetectable, and I'm going to be honest with you all. <coughs> they have been all, all the way since then. I mean, duh. That is crazy. Your call of shame. No anti-cheat will ever be able to detect them, and I'm oh devastated telling you this. PC gaming is finished. If my superhero Call of Shame is devastated, then what about you and I, guys? What about you and I? These are hardware cheats. Before I explain about them, I want to show you something to help you better understand how they work. This no, is what I don't want to understand right now, bro. I need the solution to this problem that's happening, bro. I don't need any of this, bro. And hey, man, listen. I want you on that Miami alien case, too, bro. Uh, guys, there's a lot of alien UFO videos being shared left and right. If you are into that, definitely check out my second channel because uh, the US actually leaked uh, a jellyfish UFO, which you may or may not heard. Uh, there's also a 10 feet tall alien looking creature spotted in on a Brazilian mountain. There's a lot of crap oh, happening man call of shame we need you i know you're a nasa disgruntled employee you literally just wave the white flag and that's sad that's sad but we need you on that alien staff uh stuff too homie what a cheat developer had to say about it and you better believe high profile warzone streamers are using this we are not changing memory of the game and don't run any suspicious software on the gaming pc so it is the best option in terms of safety and overall undetection because okay. detection of a hardware cheat is an extremely hard task to do, and I would say... Brother is sounding like the McDonald's version of Andrew Tate, though. Like, pretty much impossible bruh. for anti-cheats. That is why such cheats are extremely popular among pro players and streamers. The way it works is that the direct memory access card is plugged into a PCI slot on the gaming computer. This then reads the memory of the game in question. 
It is constantly sending information to a second computer. This is done simply via the US... <coughs> Yo, what? What is happening to the games, bro? What is happening to the games, eh? Back in the days, we used to just have red dots, which is something that I talked about, and then we actually got, you know, wall hacks, uh, smaller, like, aimbot programs, which, you know, it was available to very few people. Then we got the... Then we had the tick tick ticks, um, so guys would be juicing. Then came the era of G Fuel. I, I know that's not cheating, but you know what I mean, right? Like these uh, streamers, these toxic ass gamers would be high on G Fuel, Adrill, and Lord knows what else. They would be high on these stimulants, uh, getting that dopamine, trying to chase that dopamine, right? It's a never-ending cycle. These suckers be getting way more dopamine than all of our ancestors combined that actually tried to climb Mount Everest and succeeded. Not even my ancestors that climbed Mount Everest, even they couldn't even get this amount of dopamine that these suckers are getting within like five minutes like that. Buying, buying a hardware, buying a cheating device, and then directly cheating in the game and getting easy kills like that. Bro, holy man, that is, it's Joel, it's chalked. Speak it's cable. chalked. The cheats are running on the streaming computer, not the gaming one. Since Ricochet is only interested in the gaming computer that run the Call of Duty client, the second PC can run the cheats all day and completely undetected. Any serious gamer uses a LAN cable and not Wi-Fi. The Wi-Fi card... And the craziest thing here is that most streamers that play that are like decent size on YouTube, this is something that is general information, right? Most people or most streamers that play on PC and that have like decent, let's just say following, let's just say 100k subs or more, they actually play game on one uh, computer and then they have another computer to stream from oh, because they want to play the game at max graphics settings and, and they want to be streaming at like good quality at the same time as well otherwise their pc will be sent to pc heaven if they actually game on both for for months on end obviously once or twice that's fine but some of these streamers are making videos every single day streaming every single day so you cannot do that your pc is gonna be sent to console heaven okay or pc heaven i should say and uh it kind of makes sense. I mean, half of them, I would like to believe, have these uh, cheating devices installed on their PCs like that, and this is why they don't get detected. Uh, this is why recently, I believe, like, Sickers have been pointing out that Swag actually, you know, played on console, and he wasn't playing the same way he was playing on PC. I wonder why. These Sickers need to play. Everybody that's actually... Uh, accused of cheating in games, they need to play at LAN and also on a console. And that's when we can better judge whether they are good or cheating. ...can even be removed and the DMA cheat Pots. card can be flashed to disguise it as a Wi-Fi card. Thus making PC checks irrelevant and hiding from everything. DMA cheats also allow the user to have a 100% undetectable aimbot. However additional hardware is required that allows the user to plug their mouse directly into the box. So, in short, the DMA card reads directly from your memory. <laughs> Oh he got the homie swag, my guy, he doesn't even know what a radar hack is, bruh. Thus sending back information the cheat tool is requesting on the streaming PC or second laptop. Second laptop. Since Ricochet only it. care about what's on this PC, this allows streamers to cheat and never get detected. DM I, I'm pretty positive somebody's probably watching this video rubbing his hands like sitting in dark and be like I'm gonna buy this, I'm gonna buy this You are not gonna buy this, okay? You listen to me right now, you're not gonna buy this, you're not gonna buy this man, you're not gonna buy this bro Mate cheats are nothing new, and they have been around for some time now Despite them being somewhat of an underground cheat that streamers were using They are now available to the public to be used in Warzone Rip And the cheating Rip. is rampant in the all-female league a developer. Yeah, a lot of these females are gonna be like, I'm strong, I'm independent, if I can get a BBL, therefore I'm gonna buy this hacking device as well and cheat in the game, but it's all natural, just like how my BBL is natural. ...who has created many of these cheats, stated the following. We're cheats on UCA and face it right now, and not a lot of people know about it. So Underground. Not, yeah, they, and they charge a lot of money, like thousands of dollars for this. Okay, so, I was gonna ask yeah. whether your device was like, uh, you know, one of the first of its kind, but I'm guessing not um, so really. Yeah, yeah. So the the aimbot part definitely. Is. So the aimbot part, I haven't seen anything that that works like that. Um, I've seen some some like uh, proof of concepts, but nothing that actually works. And the videos you find on YouTube are very much almost fake. But the uh, radar and the sound ESP are definitely out there. 
if some if, yeah, if like yeah, someone sure. didn't have a clue what it was and you had to kind of break it down into non techy layman's terms in a right. brief summary, how would you do it? <laughs> the non techy way it's kind of hard because it's it's pretty like advanced kind of cheat. Yeah, agree. Um, but I'll try. I'll try. I'll try. So. Not even the aliens have this technology is what he's trying to say, guys. Basically, the normal cheat you have is software cheats. They're just programs that run on your computer, and okay. they uh, modify the game's memory. And so they get from the main game's memory uh, play positions, all stuff like that. But there's also anti-cheats running, like ESA anti-cheat, face anti-cheat, that try to de uh, detect these kind of programs. And what my cheat does, and so some cheats, like, more under yeah! that. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! He is a cheat manufacturer! He's a cheap manufacturer, bum bum bumbocard. Bum kind of stuff is they have a, a little chip that you insert into the motherboard of your uh, of your PC, and it can read the game memory directly. So it, it doesn't have to run any programs on the target PC, like on a PC you're playing on, uh, and it can just get the player positions and your view angles and all you, you need to make a successful cheat. It can read that with a little chip um, without any software. And so what my my aimbot is, is it has, it's a little device that's between your mouse and your PC. Dog, back in the day, suckers would be like, you know, selling water bottles. Hey, you thirsty? Here's a water bottle, man. Say no more. So back in 2020, suckers would, were selling like those masks. And now these suckers are like, that's my aimbot, man. I'm proud, you know, I'm, I'm proud right now. I'm proud, you know what I'm saying? Like, I made an aimbot for these kids and I'm solving world hunger. I'm solving these kids' problems. I'm solving these ADHD problems. I'm solving dopamine flowing problems. Bro, it is Jover, guys. PC on gaming, at least the FPS games on PC as we know it, it is Jover. And recently, Dr. Disrespect went absolutely crazy. Click on this video on the screen. Because what he actually said during this live stream where this cheater was caught cheating is absolutely insane. Click on it and I will see you right there.